that little white crane has been eluding me for two seasons. Every time I try to get his picture with the zoom lens, he decides to fly away. Just have to be patient. So he's very elusive. I'm kind of behind a tree to break up my profile. But last year I tried to get him and every time I would go to the next pond, he would fly away. They're very shy. Just have to be patient. This little guy is elusive. I'm trying to be quiet. And I'm just hiding my profile behind trees and then just taking quiet steps. So I got as close as I could to this little guy. Each step as quiet as possible. I'm just hiding behind a tree and I'm about 120 feet away. About as close as I can get. Um, without getting in the grass, but he's beautiful. He's very hard to, very elusive. Unfortunately, the wind direction has changed, so we're upwind from him or her. He's so gorgeous. This is a little pond near my house, and this guy is. far out optical zoom on this camcorder as possible and holding it as still as possible. I think the landscaping in the background is kind of quieting my movements and my steps. He's definitely has piqued his interest. You just have to be real patient when you're taking wildlife. Let them just stay patient. Be as quiet as possible. Use cover. Try to break up your profile. And just be patient. get real close to him, we'd use a speed light and light him up. This is perfectly fine. Just don't harass him and don't bother him. And that's wildlife in general. They will come to you if they perceive you as no threat. If you're not encroaching on their environment or they're young, then they will just, if you leave them alone, they will leave you alone. And you get a decent telephoto lens. I'd say 200 is good depending on how far you want to go. Obviously the higher lenses you're going to need a tripod. A 600 millimeter lens would give you a lot greater distance. But you're going to need a tripod and you're going to need to lug it around. So just up to you to find that happy medium. But wildlife will come to you. Just be patient.